and let me just take a photo from the camera so this is how the camera UI actually look like so again this is how the camera UI look like the camera UI has been enhanced and let me just take a photo of my iPhone 6 over there so it does take a little amount of time to focus but it does have tap to focus and auto focus is also there you have support for HDR mode as well and this is something which is related to how you would like to take the photos in the normal board you can actually touch on the screen you can have a timer or you can have a voice to take the photos these are the different ways of taking photos talking about the settings we have the settings over there for the photos so 16 is to 9 expect ratio is there for the photos as of now and you can select the scene mode in case you would like to do that when it comes to video resolution it can record high definition video at 1080p and 720p and 480p resolution videos can also be recorded and here we have some more settings let me just toggle to the front camera and i can show you the quality of the front camera as well so this is how the front camera look like the front camera does have face detection and it can take very good selfies and i can just take a selfie of my and show you the same and it does apply a certain amount of beautification to the photos which we have captured so as you can see uh, the amount of details it has captured from the front camera the front 5 megapixel camera on this device is definitely a very good camera it can take very good photos and let me just show you uh, the other one which i have taken uh, from this device this is the one which has been taken from the rear camera again this has been taken in low light and the kind of details i can see in this photo is really good the color production is again good but not too great but again in low light it has performed a very good thing uh, it has the camera has performed uh, very nicely uh, especially in terms of rendering the details as well as colors so colors are good nicely reproduced but not great color production i would say this is Hey guys, this is Abhishek from GaddisTube.com and today we are recording this video from the front camera on the Lenovo Vive X2 and this device is a 5 megapixel uh, front camera which is a fixed focus camera and as of now, I, as you can see, this is how it will look like when you do a video chat from this device depending on the light conditions uh, if you are against light, then uh, you will be like this and if you are in flow of the light, then uh, things will change like this Again, it is uh, handling the light uh, quite nicely, but it is taking some time to focus and to show me basically. Uh, and uh, this is how the scenario will change when you come in natural light. And you can get an idea about the video clarity as well as the audio clarity from this device when you record a video from the front camera or whenever you do a video chat from the front camera. That's how it will be. Thanks for watching this video. This is Abhishek signing off. Thank you. Hey guys, this is Abhishek from GadgetStudio.com and today we are recording this video from Lenovo Vive X2 and this is the kind of clarity you can actually expect from the rear camera on this device which is a 13 megapixel camera. This video is being recorded in high definition resolution and hopefully it should be good. We will give you more details about this device once we get this device for full review. But this is how it is as far as the clarity is concerned when it comes to recording a video from the rear camera on this device. This, these are the kind of details you can expect. And when it comes to this kind of a scenario, this is how the quality will get changed. You can get an idea about how does it actually handle different colors and uh, different light conditions. The kind of detail, details I can see on the screen is looking good. And with the overall color production, especially while recording this video, at least on the display of this phone is looking nice. And rest you will confirm once we upload this video. These are the package content for the Lenovo Vibe Z which you will get within the package. You also get a back cover uh, and film free within the package of this phone. 
so these are the things and you also have an additional accessory which you can buy so this is how the clarity will look like when you record a video from Lenovo Vive X2 which is the latest flagship phone it comes with MediaTek 6595 chipset and the octa core processor clocked at 2 GHz and let's see how does it perform the pricing of this device is approximately 26,000 rupees which is kind of a higher side I would say but let's see how does it actually go and perform in the market do let us know if you have any specific question for this device we would love to help you thanks for watching this video this is Abhishek signing off